Now, can we have some of the awardees on the stage for sharing their experiences and the views? So, can we have Ms. Bhavna Rawat from EC to share some of her views? A very good afternoon to our Honorable Chief Guest, Professor T.G. Sita Raman, Chairman AICT, Honorable VC Sir, Registrar Sir, Dean IRD, and all the revered dignitaries on and off the dais. I, Bhavna Rawat, am a research scholar working under Professor Purnima Mittal in Department of EC. I am honored to be here today and grateful to be a recipient of the revered Research Excellence Award 2023. I joined DTU in January 2020 and I remember during the first semester one day when discussing about work, ma'am mentioned about the awards and she promised that we'll work hard and one day I'll be able to apply for it. That day, ma'am had more faith in me than I probably had in myself. But today, being here feels surreal and overwhelming. I'm extremely grateful to ma'am, our entire department, including all its members, the distinguished faculty members who have time and again helped us at different avenues, the staff who facilitates our day-to-day -day working, my fellow researchers for all the serious discussions and light moments that keep me going. The research award has always kept each one of us motivated, but it has also educated us in terms of different categorizations of journals. As a newbie in the research world, my knowledge of publication houses and journals was very limited. When I saw the award list, it opened up a new world of journals, their rankings and categorizations. If it hadn't been for the list, maybe I would have discovered the Royal Society Publishing House much later in my career. And all thanks to DTU, its policies and leadership that today I have a publication in such a well-reputed leading, well-reputed journal leading me being a recipient of the Premium Research Award. DTU is one of those very few premier institutions where when a scholar receives an acceptance email, the first question your friends ask is which category? And then the celebrations and congratulations begin. All this is possible because of the healthy, positive, and nurturing on-campus research environment. I take this liberty to extend a wholehearted thank you to our revered VC sir, Registrar sir, Dean IRD, and the entire DTU family from all the research scholars. Thank you all. Next, can we have Professor Anil Kumar Haritash from Environmental Engineering. A uh, very good evening to all the dignitaries seated on the dais, fellow faculty members and dear students. Uh, this uh, Research Excellence Award, it was initiated in the year 2017 and since then it has progressed. And uh, today we are harvesting its benefit uh, worth rupees 1.52 crores. And I hope the, the vision that the DTU authorities had at the time of it, its inception uh, the same vision is being progressively uh, coming into reality. Uh, although these certificates and cash awards are the uh, sort of tangible benefits that the faculty is getting, but there are, of course, at the same time, some intangible benefits associated with these awards. And those intangibles, the first one is the uh, uh, very congenial academic and research environment that DTU has over the period of time provided to its faculty and the students. So that's very important. Uh, the other thing is, uh, 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 as, as Sir had said, that there is always a difference between academics and research, and the two are many a times counted separately. But actually, both are, are, are complementing each other. And since inception of these Research Excellence Awards, uh, we have witnessed that there is uh, a seamless integration of academics and research over the period of time. And this is, again, the other intangible benefit that we, we have achieved because of these uh, uh, research excellence awards. The third very important aspect is that, that earlier it was mostly related to the textbook teaching. And these days, the students from the textbook, they are reaching to the laboratory also. And they are getting first-hand experience on, on different aspects related to research, related to their respective subjects. And it has uh, helped develop the problem-solving skills among the students, mostly. 
Uh, earlier when we asked the students, which, uh, please, please come with some problem and some research papers related to the subject, they were mainly uh, put, uh, getting the papers from the online platforms and nobody was worried about what quality of research papers, what quality of research journal it is. But these days, uh, most of the students, they don't do so. They, at the very beginning, compare the, 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 the journals, which journals are better and which are not. After it, they also analyze the quality of research paper. It could be a good journal, but the quality may not be that good. So that, that quality of research paper is also analyzed even by the research scholars this, this, this day. And uh, apart from it, they have also been able to identify what, what utility, means social utility or economic utility or utility in terms of technology that particular paper has, has got. So that sort of uh, analyzing abilities have also been inculcated because of these research excellence awards among the students uh, very particularly. So th these are few of the, some, some of the intangible benefits that we are getting as a result of these, the, these awards. And of course for these awards, uh, uh, for the inception and for uh, running through, for carrying that, that, that tradition through, uh, the university authorities have always been very supportive. and. Uh, uh, from the faculty, on, on, on behalf of the faculty, we can, we can assure that uh, we, the faculty as well as the research students, all the research community will, will, will be maintaining the standard of academics and research and uh, we will uh, further be taking the torch forward uh, in this aspect and uh, we, uh, lastly I would like to acknowledge all the support uh, that we have got from the university authorities in terms of uh, support for, uh, for providing a congenial academic and research environment, for providing all the infrastructure related to research, uh, be it uh, the projects, be it the instruments, uh, uh, be it other things related to. And, and, and uh, I, I sincerely thank the authorities for appreciating the efforts of students and faculties through these Research Excellence Awards. And uh, it, 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 of course, requires a very big heart to disperse about 152 lakh rupees in a day. And our uh, DT authorities uh, are to be congratulated for the commitment. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir, for your views. May I now request our Honorable Vice Chancellor, sir, to present memento to our Chief Guest, Professor T.G. Sitaram, as an expression of our gratitude. Finally, now I would like to invite Professor Roli Purwar, Associate Dean IRD, to give the concluding remarks. In addition to being Associate Dean IRD, Dr. Purwar is a talented researcher who has published several research papers in Indian and international peer-reviewed journals. She also has two patents to her credit and has guided more than seven PhD students. A very good evening to everyone. With immense pleasure, I am proposing this vote of thanks for six Research Excellence Award. The journey of this six award function is started in the month of December 2022, when Honorable Vice Chancellor Professor J.P. Saini gave his permission to organize this award function. We are grateful to him for his support, guidance, and every step of the way. I am thankful to Professor T.G. Sitaram Chairman AICT, for accepting our invitation, your presence and words of wisdom have truly inspired all the young researchers and the DTU fraternity. Thank you so much, sir. I am grateful to Professor Madhusudan Singh, Registrar DTU, Professor Pragati Kumar, Dean IRD, for their all-time unconditional support and valuable suggestions for organizing this function. I am thankful to Professor Rajeshwari Pandey and Professor Rinku Sharma for their gracious presence. I take this opportunity to express my sincere thanks to the scrutiny committee members, Professor Nita Pandey, Professor Anil Kumar from Applied Chemistry, Fro Professor C.P. Singh, Professor Raju Sarkar, Professor Yasha Hasija, Professor Anjana Gupta, Professor Dinesh Vishkarma, Professor Rishu Chaujar, Professor Mini Shrijet, Dr. Praveen Kumar, Dr. Anil Kumar from Mechanical Engineering, Dr. Rajiv Mishra, Dr. Harikesh, Dr. Nidhi Mahishri, Dr. Ambrish Panwar, Dr. Sonal Tukral, Dr. Pawan Singh Mehra for evaluating the applications of Research Excellence Award and their recommendations. 
I express my sincere gratitude to the scrutiny committee members of Citation Award for Professor Neeta Pandey, Professor Praveer Kumar, Professor Ram Singh, Professor Ruchika Malhotra, Professor Dinesh Vishkarma, Dr. Anil Kumar from Mechanical Engineering, Dr. M. J. Shimadri, Dr. Harikesh for evaluating the application and their recommendations. My sincere thanks to our editorial team, Dr. Anil Kumar from Mechanical Engineering and Dr. Praveen Kumar for timely completion of Research Excellence Compendium and preparation of certificates. I am thankful to all organizing committee members. A special thanks to Professor Neeta Pandey and her team, Professor Rishu Chaujar, Dr. Parnita, Professor Dinesh Vishkarma and his team, Professor Amish Shirvastav and his team, Professor Rijwan and his team, Professor Rahul Kataria and his team, Professor S. Indu and Professor Ram Singh, Dr. Anil Kumar, Deputy Registrar, member from, from DTU Studio for their constant support for organizing this function. Last but not the least, I am thankful to my PhD scholars, Ms. Dan Kaur, Mr. Jitain Kumar, Ms. Mekha Boch, and staff of IRD who work day and night for past one month to make this program successful. For our inspiring researcher, I would like to add two lines from my side. Be active, take responsibilities, work for the things you will believe in. My best wishes to all award recipients. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am, for your words of wisdom. A big thank you to everyone out here, for we had an excellent event. We hope everyone has savored each moment of the proceedings to the fullest. Nazar nazar mein utarna kamal hota hai. Nafs nafs mein bikharna kamal hota hai. Bulandiyo pe pahunchna koi kamal nahi. Bulandiyo pe thairna kamal hota hai. 